Welcome back. As the race to create a vaccine to prevent more coronavirus infections continues, as hospitals are using antibodies from people who have recovered from COVID-19. That's right, News 15's Cassie Sherm learns just how easy it is to give the plasma and why one Lafayette resident's resident continues to donate. When it comes to needles, sometimes people can get a little nervous giving blood or even plasma. Well, I sat down with a Lafayette nurse while she was giving her antibodies, and she says it's a super easy thing to do to help save a life. There was a point where I thought my body's failing. I'm not going to make it. Karen Weibel, a Lafayette general nurse, became very ill back in February. It escalated to 103 fever, excruciating headache, lower backache that was intolerable. But at that time, no one was talking about COVID-19 here in Louisiana. Every test I took was negative. And the scariest part for me was not knowing what was happening to me. Weeks later, the first case of coronavirus was diagnosed in the state, but it wasn't until last week that Weibel was able to take an antibody test at work to see if that's what she had. I came back positive. And I was relieved <laughs> to know, you know, what was wrong with me because it was emotional. Everything was negative, but my body was failing. That same week, she donated her plasma to help others, and now she's back at it again. I always knew I wanted to be a nurse since a little girl because I wanted to help others and give. To be able to give something you have back to heal people, it's an amazing thing. The process to give takes about two hours. Please, please, please. And Weibel says anyone can do it. Being on this machine and giving is not anything compared to the symptoms of the coronavirus. And once more people are tested in the area, she thinks others will join her. I know as people become positive and realize that they have an opportunity to give, they'll be given their plasma. So Weibel is resting easy. You sit back and just say, okay, I'm gonna give now. Knowing that she can make a difference. You got a good amount? Oh yeah, we good. One donation at a time. How many people can we save with that one? At least, four. At least four. Isn't that awesome? If you'd like to join her and others who are donating their plasma to COVID-19 patients who are currently in the hospital, you can go to vitalent.org where you can fill out the paperwork and they'll set you up with a time and an appointment. In Lafayette, I'm Cassie Sherm, News 15.